Okay, let's try again, shall we? Um, this is the unveiling. We've already missed half of it because of an SD card there. That's great. So anyway, this is as um, it's arrived. Korea down. Um, seven Seiko watches. I paid 230 quid. Literally, there was just one picture. So we'll see what we get, shall we? It's like Christmas, isn't it? Da -da, da -da, da -da, da -da. Oh, it's quite a weight. It's a good sign, isn't it? Rather than the Chinese ones. Let's have a look. I mean, it could all be fake. Wow. I hope we wrap them individually. So I think it's kind of like maybe an auction type site. Oh, do you not wear them individually? Doesn't look like it, does it? So they've been rattling around all the way down. Excellent, that's the original. That's the one we're looking at mainly. That's what's wrong with that one. Oh, it's got the original Seiko strap on it. Now in the picture, this one looks like it had a massive um, scratch down the screen. So we'll um, have another look. Okay, so we've got, that's quite strange. I've never seen one like that. So we have I've never seen one like that. A couple of heavy scratches on the crystal there. There you go, and that's um, my missus, obviously. There we go. I can't really get that focus that well. Might look better on the actual video. I'll go grow focus. Keep doing it. Nice, that's that little one. It's quite an interesting one, that is. Now, I don't have any reason to believe these are fake. That definitely doesn't. Any crown wheel there. Definitely doesn't look fake, that one. But that wasn't, I wasn't really fussed about that one. It's quite a nice ladies' watch. A big Seiko. It's a monster of a thing. Is that an automatic as well? So that's just lost a. Thing maybe needs a battery. Yeah, so that one's going to need a battery. That's huge. That's a really big fat watch. Okay, got a chuff for that one. That's not a canoe. Wow. Let's have another look, should we? Okay. So those of you who know your Seikos, will possibly know what I'm looking for. Fake Seikos tend to have a little notch taken out here. The strap doesn't have a serial number on it, um, whereas the original ones do. And to be honest, you can tell just with a real one. Oh, that's lost its crown wheel. So that's okay. That's no biggie, is it, really? Losing a crown wheel. Uh, this one. Could just need a battery. Again, look, see if it's got the inset. They're really filthy if you can see by the pictures. 
which is kind of a good sign because it means they may have been warm. Um, so I mean, look at that. That's absolutely hanging there. That pretty gross, huh? But it could be a good sign. So we have another Seiko. Got a broken strap, which is no biggie really. And is that the original? Yeah, that's the original Seiko. Seiko strap there. Wow, that's brilliant. So that's quite a good sign. Again, there's no notches out here. I'll check serial numbers out. Or maybe people watching can tell me. Five three seven two seven two. And then you also check the movement. If that's gonna well, let's hope I don't have to use that bag again. Oh, I can't even see that movement without a loop on. The one thing to do is you check the movement it says down there is actually inside the watch, and then when you pull the back off, you can actually see none of these backs have been removed by the looks of it. This one is actually working. There we go. Is that another kinetic one? Is it? I wonder if these people look at it and they don't notice the second hand going down and around on that one until you press that button. Again, filthy, filthy watches. And that one I think I might wear now. And see if we can get it going again. I don't... I mean, just looking at the general condition of that movement, I wouldn't have said that was a copy. No way would I have said the detail in there is just too nice. You've got the machining across the edge of the pieces inside it just looks too too nice same with the machining on there and it's got filth on it which is great because it does tend to add to the authenticity of it being used I quite like that watch actually that was the biggest one and this one i thought it had to be cracking the crystal so it must have just been a reflection or something so what, what you can do is get get this put on a it's got an interesting sweep on that second hand, isn't it? I wonder if it'd be worth putting this on a winder. So guys in the shop will have one. I just keep wearing it today. <laughs> 